Vlogmas Day 13. Today um, is off to a late start. Well, this vlog is at least. Um, I woke up early this morning. Um, <laughs> actually about uh, my cat and like animal control, but that's a different story. Um, and then my boyfriend came over and then I got ready and took my dad to lunch for his birthday. His birthday was the 10th, um, but as his <laughs> as his <laughs> gift, I took him to lunch. So I took him to lunch, and then I came home and just hung out for a little bit. Because today's my day off. I don't have any work today. So I decided to come to TJ Maxx and Target and do some Christmas shopping. Um, I feel like this is kind of last-minute Christmas shopping, even though it's the 13th. I feel like I've just put off this year Christmas shopping because I can't find... Like, if I can't find the exact thing, some, or, if, or if I can't figure out something, like a really good gift, I, like don't want to get anything like I really want to get like a perfect gift for someone or like for certain people so that's what I'm doing right now um I want to get stuff for like my mom and my cousin and I still have to figure out my boyfriend's gift I think I figured it out are you getting I... anything no <laughs> that's what I'm doing right now and I will see you when we're in TJ Maxx I guess okay so I didn't film anything in TJ Maxx it was kind of hectic I think everyone else is also trying to do like Christmas shopping but I'll show you what I got. I ended up getting two, the two things I wanted to get for my mom. Um, like, the exact things. Um, first off, I wanted to get her... I know she's not going to watch this, or I hope she's not going to watch this. If you are watching this for whatever reason, stop watching. First thing, I really wanted to get her an apron because she doesn't have anything that's, like, cute. I wanted to get her, like, a cute apron. Like, the ones you see from, like, um, anthropology. She just doesn't have anything, like, cute for the house or, like... She just has like the basics of everything. So I thought I wanted to get her something really cute. And she cooks a lot and bakes, I guess. So I got her this cute little apron. It's like exactly what I was looking for. I was actually about about to buy one from Anthropology for like $40, but this was only 10. And it looks like a little dress almost and it has the cute buttons and it's like lime green or like a cuter version of lime green, like a like an earthier version. And then it has, I think, pears. Yeah, pears at the bottom of it. Of, like, the thing that looks like a skirt. I actually thought it was so cute. I love the buttons on it and, like, the look of it. I hope she likes it. I mean, if she doesn't like it, I'll honestly just wear it. But it's so cute. My mind was, like, blown. Like, I was shook when I saw this. Because I went shopping with her um, a couple weeks back. And she found this purse, like, downtown at this boutique. And she's like, oh, this is, like, the perfect purse. Like, this is so cute. And it looks like her. And so I was going to buy it for her. And it was, like, a little bit. It was, like... It, was, it wasn't pricey, but it was, like, a little, like, a lot for a purse, I guess. And then I found the exact one at TJ Maxx for $20. Like, this is the exact purse, and this is the only one left. And my mind was literally blown. Like, exact color, like, everything. So I thought she could use this, um, or wear it for my ball. Or just, like, whenever, if she's going to, like, a nice thing. Because she doesn't really have a lot of, like, clutches. So I just couldn't believe that they had this for cheaper. But... That's what I got for my mom. I, brought, I got her some other stuff too, but like not from TJ Maxx. Now I'm going into Target. I'm mainly going there to get something for my cousin, and then I'm also going to get some stuff for the baby I nanny for. I really wanted to get her a few things for Christmas just because, I don't know, I just become close with her over the past like six months, and I just thought it'd be sweet to get her some like clothes or something. So I'm gonna go look, that'll be fun, and I'll bring you along with me. Oh my gosh, this is so much fun. I have no idea what to get her. I don't know if I should get her clothes or toys or what. I don't, oh my god. Cute. Oh, cute. I just want to get her everything. So this is what I've picked out so far. This thing looks like a dog toy, but apparently it's for babies. I mean, it's for like ages whatever um <laughs> that like want to play with it. I think it's meant for teething. It doesn't say that anywhere. And it's kind of like a rattle, but I think it's like made out of like natural wood it says. So I think this is for teething, and the baby I named for teething a lot right now. So I feel like this might be good if that's what it's for, but I'll figure that out later. Uh, I think I'm going to get her some socks because she wears socks a lot when I'm around, and a lot of the ones she's kind of outgrown. So I think I'm going to get her these. I'm thinking about maybe getting her these too because she's starting to like kind of eat with her hands right now, and obviously like... I don't think it'll, I think it'll be a while before she can like, use a fork or a spoon, but um, I feel like the mom always kind of needs more spoons, so maybe these will be handy. And then for clothes, I have uh, lots of options. Um, I'm thinking of this outfit, and I like this because it's like a, a top in like pants, and then it comes with a little headband, and I just think it's really cute. It has like fawns on it. 
So th that's an option, and this is a dress, and it has a cute little vest. I feel like this would be more practical, so I might go with that one. This one's just kind of cute. But yeah, and I like that they're not like too Christmassy, so she can wear them like after Christmas. But then there's also this one, which comes with the jacket, pants, and then like a little, I don't know, like a onesie. So that might be, I don't know, I might choose that one. But I'm, I'm really confused with sizing too, because she's smaller than her age, and she's about 10 months. But they don't have any 10 months, but they have 9 months, so I'm thinking of getting that, or they have 12 months. So she can probably, like, I don't know, wear that for longer. So I don't know, I'm going to have my mom come over, come over here and, like, help me out. Alright, so I'm back from Target now. I'm actually also back from choir practice. I had choir practice right after Target, and I was running a little bit late, so I didn't really film anything else in Target, or when I left Target. And also, if you can hear, like, really dull music playing in the background, my little sister's, like, blaring music. So I don't know if you can hear it or not, but I can hear it. Um, so yeah, I thought I'd show you what I got for the baby at Target. So I got something for my boyfriend, but I'm not going to show that because I know he's watching this. And you're not allowed to see what I got you. For the baby, the first thing that I got were these cute little socks. She always wears socks when I'm over there. And I feel like she's kind of growing out of them. So I got her these cute socks. And the outfit I decided on is this one. It's so cute. This is like my favorite all of all of them. And I, it was an easy decision. My mom kind of helped me out. Um, she also helped me with the sizing though. I ended up getting 12 month because I figure it's always better to go bigger than smaller. But it comes with these cute leggings that have little fawns on them and like some sparkles. I don't know how well you can see. But and then it has this really soft little shirt with like three gold buttons. And it comes with a headband. It's so cute. I'm so excited about this. Um, I'm probably also going to get her, like, a little toy. I wanted to look at, like, Toys R Us for that, though, because Target didn't have, like, a lot of options. Like, everything there at Target was, like, stuff she already had. I was like, well, I know where she shops now, but, um, and she has a lot of toys, so I don't want to get her anything, like, big. I want to go to Toys R Us and see if there's anything that, like, catches my eye that she doesn't have or, like, would use a lot. I also thought I would do my advent calendar right now. I already opened it earlier. Actually, I already opened it earlier. I just thought I would show you what I got for... The 14th? Wait a second, what's today's date? Okay, I just checked, I guess it is the 14th. I thought, all day I thought it was the 13th. Um, that was kind of scary, I didn't realize it was, oh, I think I said Vlogmas Day 13. Shoot. All right, so for the 14th, I got this lipstick. It's one of the butter lipsticks, and this is in Root Beer Float. And it's so cute, I think I'm actually gonna put it on right now. It's like a berry color something I could see myself wearing a lot and I think it's one of the matte ones I've actually never tried any of the butter lipsticks I've tried the matte ones and I've liked them a lot I'm not a huge lipstick person though also my lips have been so dry I think it's because I'm so used to it being so humid out and now they're just like freaking out I love this so much I thought it'd be a lot darker than it is I mean it looks kind of dark on camera but it's so pretty I really like the formula of this too um, I actually think I might wear these for my pictures that I have on the 22nd I feel like I want to wear something long-lasting for the actual ball, but for the pictures, I just want something that looks kind of natural and pretty. Oh, I love this so much. Okay, so this is the one in Reap Your Float. I recommend this. This is one of the butter lipsticks from NYX. I just remembered I didn't vlog yesterday, so I didn't show you what I got yesterday in my advent calendar. But I got another one of the matte liquid suede. Actually, I don't know if it is matte. One of the liquid suede lipsticks. And this is in Vintage. And this is like a dark brown... It's kind of a purpley brown. I think it's pretty. I don't know when I'd wear it, but I think it's pretty, and I want to maybe try wearing it more. What I really like about the advent calendar is, like, I get a ton of colors that I feel like I would never wear, and then I've tried some of them out, and I like them a lot. And they come in, like, sample sizes, so, like, I can try out different formulas and different colors, but it's not like I bought, like, 24 lipsticks. So, that's really cool. I really like trying this out, and um, I feel like I might do, like, a review at the end of of December of like what my favorite lip products were um from NYX and maybe stuff that I thought I wouldn't like and like what my I don't know what I recommend anything like that I don't know if that's interesting but oh my gosh I have marks from my glasses anyway I'm gonna probably make some dinner now Part two. 